Uh, all the capo is is a way of changing keys and you're basically just moving up the neck. When you capo this on the first fret you would be in G sharp or A flat. The second fret is A. Third fret is B flat. And the fourth fret is B. And so, uh, but that's playing from the the, the G shape. So if you want to get up into the key of A, you simply capo on the second fret. And uh, I like to put my capo right over the top of the fret. And then you have to remember to raise the fifth string up the same amount that you raise the this capo. So. I have spikes on my banjo neck, so I am raising this string up two frets. And it always goes sharp on you, so the important thing here is to make sure you're in tune. Whether you capo a guitar, a banjo, mandolin, or clarinet. Be sure that you are in tune, okay? Always be in tune. Alright, so here's Mama Don't Lao, a little bit of Mama Don't Lao, up in the key of A. Now we're going to go on up to the key of B. So, if I wanted to be in B flat, I would just move up one more fret. And I would tune my fifth string up one half a step because I don't have a spike right there. But I would tune that to five frets above my capo. And I could do Mama Don't Allow in B flat. But means we want to be in A, in B I mean. Now we go up to the fourth fret. So now So now we're up there in the key of B, and here's how the rhythm part for Mama Don't Lao would go up in the key of B. Mama 